you'll need a Torx T30 screwdriver. Align the triangle mark and guide pins on the processor socket with the triangle mark and mounting holes of the PHM. Carefully lower the PHM straight down into the processor socket. Fully tighten the numbered Torx T30 captive fasteners on the processor heatsink module in the install sequence shown on the heatsink label. This label instructs us to begin tightening fastener number one, then two, three, and four. Only tighten the fasteners until they stop. Do not over tighten. Slide the upper compute system board or filler into the compute system tray until the release clips snap into the locked position. Connect all of the cables on the compute system board that go to the connectors in the compute tray. Align and insert the connections end of the compute tray into the front of the server chassis. Fully open the blue compute tray release levers. Push the compute tray into the chassis until it stops. Rotate the blue compute tray release levers inward until they are fully closed and their latches are locked. Install the front cover.